Hello everyone and welcome back. Let's play some more more behind. And I was thinking we should put uh, Oyo under our dominion and take all of their provinces and probably make them just a vassal or something. So I am uh, going to fabricate a claim on them. Uh, fabricate on Porto and maybe just take all of their sea uh, sea provinces or something I don't know but let's just continue like this uh, let's build some spy agencies up here and make them uh, make at least these provinces more strong Uh, more money. Okay, let's build one of those. And so I think everything is colonized in here. So we can, we are going to start colonizing Madagascar. Anywho, um, so let's just—is this an autosave or something? I know th my game is glitching today for some reason, and I have no idea why. But let's just go with it then. They shouldn't be that strong. I do have another ally that is going to kind of help us from down here. Our claim is going to be fabricated pretty soon, if not already. Uh, did it. it Show superiority. So they are Pima is their ally. The Dali are their ally. Dali are already quite a lot of wars and Maritan. Marathon is this province. If Pasai joins us, which they won't because fighting in another war together. Um, so, once we finish this war, I will just declare that uh, this other one. Right, that should be uh, quite a good plan. I'm trying to kind of adjust my, my mic and everything. I know if you guys can hear. You probably can, but whatever. Am I at war with Pima right now? I am not. Okay. Okay. Though I have a lot of revolt risk, and I don't know why this game is stopping. What's wrong with the game? There's something wrong with my computer. The, the problem isn't with the uh, game, probably. Let's do some more stability. Okay. Let's just not move around too much. And I still do have two other vassals right here, which is uh, very hilarious because they haven't even thought of a revolting or anything, and they're very loyal. And I don't even, uh, I'm not even planning on taking them under my, uh, literally just kind of assimilating them or anything like that. This will. Uh, kind of make them join my trade zone in here and I will just l let that happen trade efficiency or local unrest and local trade power let's do that and the traders should gain stuff local trade power will increase quite a lot let's see still two of these armor constables I don't know if that has an effect. I can still build ports somewhere. Oh, up here. You have no ports. What the hell has, been, has Pima been doing to you? Or with you? Um, we won't re-elect him. We'll get another... Just a second. Our ideas are mainly based on military now. So let's get a mili military ruler. Uh, how, are the, how is this going? So this is going down, Aristocrats just went up a little bit. That's why it just went down, but it doesn't really matter. Anyway. Okay, so that's awesome. Psy will join right now, okay. Great. They play a uh, war, we'll take Porto. Go to Porto right away. Uh, Gulf of Almeria 
so my trade ships are being attacked but not for long because now my other ship will come should send them earlier up there stop blocking them let's send them to the right here first in I'll gather, I'll gather it is rising I can't help them though they don't really need a lot of them okay they have no chance in winning this war my uh Yafna Foix Fna so they have already sent uh my vassals and Psy has already sent armies and stuff in here so Oyo doesn't really stand a chance in beating us we are going to uh, besiege Ulster and we're going to besiege Kpe from Ulster so this guy we can kind of um, negotiate by ourselves with them your ports are blocked let's attack them here the Psy has a very strong navy of course um, and we are now kind of blockading them 100% apparently Ev each one of these lands will join my army will we'll transfer to me Joza Joza from down here really it's a 6 1 okay leave this one will be very important to us Anyway, we've already besieged one province. This one will fall pretty soon. Their their military attack is off the charts apparently. Few colonies have sustained. More behind Brazil will be formed, and now you guys will be on your own because uh, I'm not going to colonize anything. You'll just continue colonizing by yourselves. I don't really care. Okay. Two more provinces left. And this war will be finished. Send your armies up here to blockade their uh, passing. Anyway. This should fall in a day now. Come on, Porto. Why is Porto so well protected and no trade efficiency no thank you just need some money a big day for the church the papal enclave has elected this guy from Akean okay how's your vision doing by the way not good not good at all for the Catholics Catholics have been split up out here which is hilarious there's Protestants slowly uh, kind of growing up here and that's pretty interesting look is Galakia protestant? probably uh, Porto has been taken we're traveling to uh, Coimbra Coimbra okay and we're continuing that siege sure dude I want to besiege Ulster but we probably won't take Ulster. We'll just take that province down there. Um, oh yeah, no, thank you. Come on, do it. He's a piece behind us uh, with Imer. I don't know who you are, but whatever. I have a lot of gold. Let's build stuff. Okay, let's build these expensive buildings first. I'll gather. Uh, we don't have some councils. We don't have some basic building food. So let's build those first, rather than just building very expensive ones. Anywho, uh, Brazil will just start continue uh, continue uh, kind of colonizing stuff down there. So I don't really care. I I do want to just go further further in the uh, east and find India and stuff like that try to uh, steer more trade from there 
in here. That will make me more money. I'm already very rich, but the richer get the rich. The rich get richer, so that's m more important. Colony, uh, colony self sustained, where? Okay. So now I have two colonies that are free. And this is Pima Brazil, who's making even more problems now, causing more problems. Anyway. Come on, just, just fall any day now. Ulster, did Ulster fall? Yep. Constantine, the Holy Roman Empire, Emperor. So the guy I was fighting, the guy I just made peace with, is now the Emperor of the Holy Roman Empire. It's not good for me, but whatever. But he's the leader of the Catholic side, and these guys seem to be stronger. Does um, Psy help them? Not that I see, so these people could just be uh, Protestant. Follow the Protestant form and just finish that. Okay, come on, just do it. Just fall. Should have already done that. And Jesus Christ, my economy is very strong. How much from trade? 34 ducats from trade. Okay. Let's uh, make peace with Pima first. Sue for peace. I want Kape. You won't give me Kape. And Kappa. Uh, why won't you give me Kape? So I'll, I'll wait a couple of months, dude. I don't really care. Uh, let's do this. That is very important to me right now. Uh, let's give free sugar in fertility or a free sugar. Let's get those people. Let's see what we can build in here. Two ships. More dry docks. Uh, some trade depots. Some workshops, and I can't build it into the mo in the most important uh, one. Okay. Defensiveness is better. Oyo, how much? Sixty-four percent. So what don't we control from oil? Uh, I I know. Let's talk with these guys, Mayuratan. Um, release, become, uh, release the nation of Romania, and Aztec, um, give this land to Psy, nope, this one then, hmm, um, revoke Murcia and Granada, give me some money, war, war operations, and that's it. Romania is now independent and all of that. So, um, where does oil even have land? Do you have out here somewhere? I don't think so. Um, just a second. Where? Uh, that's Pima Brazil. Uh, vassalization is 110%, so no vassalization of anything. Dr. Pima, are you giving me the pair? Yes. That's 99%. Let's, uh, we can't fully annex them anyway. So I want these provinces. I don't want you to, f move, uh, to vassalize. I want you to be, um, to give me for some war reparations and transfer trade power to me. Uh, get war reparation and that's it. They don't hate me, so that's fine. I'm not doing that, dude. That's not happening. Leave Ireland is still. A little bit has still land. Pima is still in Ireland. They're Scottish. 
and you are joining my trade company. Bolivian Brazil plus five liberty desire. Okay. So now I have fully controlled this, which is hilarious. Where is that uh, company thing? As you can see. This creates gold. This creates grain. Uh, fuck it. Join them. So now we are, of course, probably the most powerful thing. 78%. Just, oh my god, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I just hit my mic. Whatever. Um, and from spoils of war, 50 gold pieces, which is going to go down quite quickly. War reparations is giving me one ducat. It's not good, but whatever. Choose between Tonkin and Morbihan has just been eradicated. Let's, um, I can't even do because I don't have any straight points. I can't even make these things my importing important trade center in Itagus is estuary so these things are giving me even more trade but now we are in the Sevilla trade thing which will trade center which will make me even more money I have a trade uh, uh, trade post in here whatever can I build a trade port down here? Trade post down here? Or do I already have one? I don't have one. So we're going to build it in Joza. That's going to give us even more power in here. <sighs> Jesus. We don't have any provinces in here, but whatever. Uh, this province hasn't been colonized yet, so we can't really build one. And we're going to send a ship. These ships in particular, in Algar, Algar, Ver, whatever. I keep calling it different names every day, so Algebra. Let's just call it Algebra. Whatever, right? Right. So, why aren't you even thinking of growing? I should hire these guys. S uh, guys from here, I mean, Civility Cosmo Fire. Uh, better relations over time, spy offensive diplomatic reputation. Let's hire that guy. Moral one means national manpower modifier. And let's hire these guys first. It will kind of uh, limit the amount of money I will get, but whatever. I want. Porto first to the court. And I love the music plus all of these just moving, it sounds so harmonious. I I don't have one in here, one of these. I have enough administrative points, so once Okay, any second now please. Now this is a trading port, giving me even more local trade power. So the trade zone in here is the North Sea, which I just kind of have 8%. I'm getting money from here, so that's funny. Anyway, I need points. I'm in need of points. There's a naval equipment manufacturer in here. <laughs> Hilarious. Um, 80 points and 80 points, so 160. If you guys don't know the math, you should probably should. Um, did the ships? Did I even send the ships in here? I didn't. Let's do ten prestige. Fuck my prestige. Uh, let's send these ships right here and start ferrying people out into these zones okay let's build some more of these guys one two three four five okay let's build these ones and send them in here to start colonizing stuff why are you stopping what is wrong with the game 
This is already half done. Uh, it's colonizing pretty quick in my opinion. So that's pretty, pretty great. Um, let's do military. Let's do some military points. That would be better in use than anything else. Long thing, buena, okay. Nate is rising in here. So, uh, my sharpshooters are pretty strong. Though they have spears and the rebellions have, have, uh, have guns. I'm sorry, I know something is buggy with me. I'm buggy, buggier than the game, which is hilarious. Anywho. I'm going to send them as a group and then split them up and I'll see. I'm sorry, I just paused the game because people were entering my room and they shouldn't actually. So, um, I don't even if I paused the game. I might have not paused the game, but whatever. You just heard the conversation in Albanian then, which you probably wouldn't understand a word of. Anywho. Okay, game, please stop blocking. Let's make this one our core. Let's do some harsh treatment against them. Is there a explorer in here? Uh, yep, so we're, you're going right there. S Jesus Christ, what's wrong with this game? Split up in two, one go here. Start sending a colonist. So we're just splitting up and uh, we're colonizing the whole of Madagascar. Syria is our new neighbor apparently. Okay. We're going to cause bell against Psy. What? What kind of cause bell do we even have? Okay. We like them a lot because of improved relations, fought to the end, honored the alliance. Violated Treaty of Tordilas. Tordesilas. Competing great power and stuff like that, but what are you colonizing, Pasai? I have the Treaty of Tordilas gives me all of this land. And all of this land. So what did they kind of colonize? Oh uh, maybe this is their land. And oh my god, you guys have colonized everything. Should be pretty, pretty uh, angry with me right now. What did you colonize that make me so angry, Sai? Where do you even, where do you have land here? I don't see anything. Ah, I don't care even. Anywho, let's build stuff. Okay, let's wait and kind of make this our core. Uh, and this culture is not accepted yet. Guilds obstruct trade. Why would you obstruct trade? Choose between these people have kind of finished, taken their course, have done their due diligence. Doesn't really matter. Okay, let's build these buildings up here. What did I do? Um, aristocrats of guilds. We lose prestige, we lose points. Let's do some prestige. I don't really care. I really want points. I mean, anywho, this will be the colonies will reach these provinces pretty soon. This one is a savanna, and this one is a jungle. And that's a savanna too. The Angelican Union, victorious, the war on religion in the Empire has ended the victorious the Angelical Union, the Emperor has been forced to abdicate and Protestantism is now the dominant faith in the Empire. Jesus, really? 
The Holy Roman Empire is a state of religious war between Catholics and Protestant faith. During religious war, the, uh, the Protestant and the Catholic League. So, uh, this league is more than stronger, and now the Emperor himself is Protestant. So, this guy is now the head of. and whatever. You can see this in a map. This is the Empire's map. This is the religious map. As you can see, it's pretty uh, the same. I don't know if any lands are that are Catholic. This map. There's some provinces like this one should join the empire right now. I don't know what you're doing. It is a league membership. Mizab has joined the Protestant League. Okay. Which pro which countries are in the La Plata? So they are. They are countries. Fighting for the empire to stay Catholic that aren't in the empire, which makes no sense. Bringing which part is this one? No, this is Poina. Where is Bringing? I have no idea. I'm not colonizing anything else. So, whatever. Manab. You join the trade one. Come on. Oh no. They have no chance in beating us. Whatever they do. They start burning us alive and then we still wouldn't have a chance really. Porto just joined and became a diplomatic points or prestige. Ah, let's just keep some prestige. Least and they they have quite a big buffer zone between orthodoxy and Catholicism, but much of these lands are just turning either Protestant or Reform. So uh, these guys will have a civil war on the, their hand if they don't do anything pretty soon. If they don't choose a side. Okay, let's send one in Nantes to be fully Catholic. 40 ducats, let's use those 40 ducats to our health. So, Protestantism is spreading. I don't know, I don't know if I join any of those religions or whatever. I, I don't really care. And I will just finish this episode right here. So guys, if you did like this video, please like, subscribe and comment and I'll see you guys later. Bye!